Hi, I'm KJ, the filmmaker slash artist. Well, artist that is, because, so I'm just gonna say, welcome to At The Art Studio, starting with me. So today I am gonna show you this art I've been working on, and this one's called The Cupcake Totem Pole Project. Well, Cupcake Totem Pole, I would say. So even though it's called Cupcake Totem Pole, cool, you kinda see that on the back, you can actually hang something on it. So I probably had to show you that image of this could be total hole that could actually be hung. Hung though, anyhow, if you want to hang it though. So probably for this project, this project was, is a completely mismedia sculpture. And it was complete on January the 15th, 2018. So it took me like six days to work on it. If you look at my Instagram account to see how long I've been working on this total pole project. Because I usually come downstairs and work on one artwork after another. But then again, you kind of see that... See that on this front side, you have a depiction of a total pole. You gotta see there happens to be a huge cupcake on the top, and here it happens to be Princess and the Cupcake thing, which happens to be this one digital artwork that you can easily find on Definitive Art thing account. And then you kinda see eight pictures of cupcakes, which happens to be this one image we discussed in our last videotape. You gotta try it out. And then we see one scene from the Cage and Julia show, which happens to be this one cupcake episode I created. Yeah, I pretty much did create a few cupcake episodes. One including at the cupcake shop and the other one is probably Millions Island and Seven Parts of some sort. And I'm not going to give you the spoiler or anything else. And then you can see on the bottom happens to be a girl and boy sharing the cupcake, which looks kind of cute. The way they have. And then on the other side you're going to see that these are just all cupcakes. And you're going to see that this one side has the depictions of Princess and the Cupcake. But to be honest with you guys, I actually did make this animated short feature and it's completely MOS and it's still a student film so I'm not going to show it to you guys today even though this is a student made film I made back in the second college I did and the other side yeah these are just a bunch of cupcake houses that I made and you could actually find this cupcake house image on that one 360 degree angled experimental film which is cupcake road or something like that and then you guys see on the bottom, there happens to be a cupcake house on the bottom, and on top is pretty much a cupcake. So I did actually use stickers, I bought these stickers from Michaels, and these cupcake house and cupcakes were actually stickers from Michaels, because I just do sell like a lot of printed sticker things when I was there at Michaels. And what's even cool about this cupcake total pole thing is that it's license under black light. So you guys see that. I use, I definitely need to use neon sharpies for this, and they look kind of cool and neat the way it glows like that with fluorescent under black light. So they're kind of neat in that cool, particular way based on how I do it though. So even if you wanted something like that, you probably had to purge yourself some black light, one you can find in Lowe's or Home Depot or something like that, or some other convenience store that are available. And what I did with this cupcake tone hole is that I actually did gloss this with a different Mod Podge that actually use these sprinkling stuff. Even though if you purchase yourself Mod Podge, you could actually purchase yourself these sprinkling Mod Podge. You can also buy these matted pad Mod Podge. You probably have to use that for matting another mixed media artwork whenever you want to do some kind of kind of collage or something, something like that. But on canvas that is. And then there's this glossy top of Mod Podge, and then there's like the outdoor Mod Podge if you want to make something for an artwork for outdoors. And I'll probably commission an outdoor Mod Podge in the future later on. And I guess that's all I have to say in order pre to present this. But for more information, you can look up more information in the description below. You can just check out my other three channels, including the playlist for more. And you can also subscribe to this channel, including you, these other two channels I have. And I'm going to say thanks for watching this show and tell us video tape by me. And make sure you give the artist and filmmaker a high five. So. Thanks for watching.